Aren't they the most precious little characters you've ever seen? Yeah, poor guy. You could feed them ten times a day, and they'll always be just about this hungry. That's a good place for my little squirrel to live right here. He's just such a cute little devil. I really like these little creatures. They bring a lot of joy to my life. A lot of joy. And I think we need to learn to respect nature and all of God's little creatures. I have never seen a squirrel this big. Biggest squirrel that I have ever seen. And he's as big, well, he's as big as a small kitty cat. A little squirrel, or whatever you had in the hand, he allows you to share a little bit of his world for a few days. And that's very special. Squirrel, they are so small. They look like little drowned rats. I want to show you what they look like today. And this is one of my little friends, and they are the most gorgeous little creatures, and I have so much fun with them. I hope you enjoy seeing those as much as, as, much as I enjoy showing them to you. But they really are precious. Little squirrels play down in here and come down dig holes and hide the acorns for winter. I still got a little squirrel. I mean, I've raised him ever since he was just a tiny baby. He's a son again, too. He lives in a great big tall cage I built. We call it, we call the cage Squirrel Hilton. <laughs> Pretty soon here, he's going to be turned loose and go back to nature. I am so fascinated with these little creatures, and I hope you are too, because I like to show them to you.